Hi students, welcome to my class once again. This is Srinivas from ZPHS level 4. In the previous session, we have learned about cuboid. What is the total surface area of a cuboid and lateral surface area of a cuboid? Isn't it my dear children? I hope you have all understood well and I hope you have done your homework also. Now today, we are going to learn the next concept in this chapter, surface areas and volumes. I mean the next concept is cube. Let us see what is a cube. Okay, the children, if you observe, which I am showing here, that is a cube. See, this is a cube. We are going to learn about a cube. See. This is a cube, isn't it? This is a cube. What do you mean by a cube? Already you have learned from 6th class onwards, 6th to 7th class, what do you mean by a cube? What is the definition of a cube? See, cube means all the sides are equal. That's why it's called a cube. Now, if I give you a net diagram for this cube, you will be knowing what is total surface area and what is the lateral surface area. Why? Because already you have learned about the cuboid, lateral surface area and total surface area. Okay, let us observe children once. Let us observe this cube is, if you open the box, cube box, it will be like this. Isn't it my dear children? If you open a cube box, it will be like this. See, this is top face. This is bottom face and the side faces and frontward, backward. Like that there are six faces for a cube. If you observe these two diagrams, how many faces does a cube have? This is the first question. How many faces are there? Six faces. Are they equal? This is the next question. See, observe all these faces. These are equal or not? Absolutely these faces are equal. Isn't it? So a cube has six faces and all the faces are equal faces. Isn't it my dear children? Let us go for the next question. If each side of the cube is L, this is L, small L. Don't think that this is one. This is L. What will be the area of each face? If each side of the cube is L, what will be the area of each face? See, this is a face. For example, this side is L. This side is L. This side is L. This side is L. That means all the sides are same. If all the sides are same in a plane figure, that is called as a square. So it is a square. Isn't it? If it is a square, the area of a square is side into side. This side measurement is L and this side measurement is L. So L into L, L square. So the area of one face, what will be the area of each face? This face area is L square. Like that L square, L square, L square, L square, all are L squares only. Okay. Now, what is the lateral surface area and the total surface area of the cube. What is lateral surface area of this cube and total surface area of this cube. By this time you might be known about the lateral surface area and the total surface area. Why? Because you are too intelligent you might be calculated what is the lateral surface area of a cube and what is the total surface area of a cube. Why? Because as I said already one face area is L square. Okay. Let us see the, in the next slide what is the lateral surface area and the total surface area. LSA and TSA of a cube. See, this is a cube. Once again, I am showing a cube net diagram very clearly and superb visibility. This is a cube. For example, this is a cuboid box. The side walls and the top walls of the box are opened and placed on a plane surface. The side walls and top 
E are opened and the place known as plane surface. See, this is the net diagram and this is the cube without ups. Okay, now length of this cube is L. Length of this cube is L. I mean breadth of the cube is L. Cube it is. That is why all are same. See, this side is L. This side is L. This side is L. This side, everything, everywhere L only. See, this is also L only. This is also L only. Why? Because it is like a square. Now, this is the first phase. Second phase. Third phase. How many phases are there? Totally six phases are there. Third phase. Fourth. Fifth. Sixth. Like that there are totally six phases. So, total surface area means all the six faces area. Let us find out. So, there are six equal faces with style L. Side is L. Six equal faces are there. Each side is L only. Now, area of each face. I said, you know, side into side. It is like a square shape. So, side into side. Side is L. L into L. So, L square. That is each face. That means one face. This face area is L. This face area is L square. Sorry, L square. This face area L square. This face area L square. Like that all the faces. So, total surface area of a cube. TSA of a cube. Since total surface area means there are six faces, each face is L square. That is why 6 into L square, 6 L square. There are six faces. Now, what is the lateral surface area of a cube? Since lateral surface area has got four faces, why four faces? Except top and bottom. Top we should not count and the bottom we should not count. This is top. This top means one and the bottom is three. One and three faces. Excluding one and three faces, we have only four, two, six, four, five. Like that only four faces are there. That is why four into L square, that is four L square. That is total surface area and the lateral surface area. See, total surface area of a cube, six L square, Lateral surface area of a cube, 4 L square. Let us see one example problem. Find the surface area of a cube whose side is 12 centimeter. Here, children, you have to observe whenever it is given surface area, that means total surface area. It is not lateral surface area. If it is lateral surface area, it will be mentioned clearly lateral surface area. If it is not mentioned, we have to understand that the area is total surface area. So what is the total surface area? Find the total surface area of a cube whose side is 12 centimeter. Total surface area half, we have a formula. By using formula, we can find out the total surface area. Let us solve what is given data. In this given data, side or edges, edges or side, both are same. Edge of a cube, L is equal to 12 centimeter. Surface area of a cube, that is total surface area. Formula is 6 L square. This L is 12 centimeter. So substitute the value of L. So 6 into L value 12, L square, that is 12 square. So 6 into 144, 12 square is 144. 6 into 144 is 864 square centimeters. Isn't it children? 864 square centimeters. This is the total surface or surface area of a cube. Surface area of a cube is if the edge is 12 centimeter and the total surface area is 864 square 
centimeter. Okay, children. I hope you understood very well this example also. So cuboid, cuboid is over. Cube also over. Now let us stop the session. We'll uh, stop it. Then we'll go for next session. Thank you very much, dear students. You are patiently you are hearing the lesson, and I hope you have understood. I hope you will do the homework which is given also. Thank you so much. We'll meet once again. Keep watching. Bye bye.